the war started in 2014. And since 2014, NATO allies have provided support to Ukraine with training, with equipment, uh, so the Ukrainian armed forces were much stronger. from the sky. Not least the need to provide uh, more ammunition and uh, also how to ramp up uh, production uh, and strengthen our defense industry to be able to uh, provide uh, the necessary uh, ammunition uh, to Ukraine and also to replenish our own uh, stocks. Um, we will also at the defense ministerial uh, meeting um, um, agree uh, new uh, long-term guidelines for our defense uh, planning to is to further strengthen our deterrence and defense, something which is uh, extremely important uh, uh, in a world which is uh, more uh, competitive uh, and more dangerous and when there's a full-fledged war going on uh, in uh, Europe. The war started in 2014, and since 2014, NATO allies have provided support to Ukraine with training, with equipment, uh, so the Ukrainian armed forces were much stronger uh, uh, in 2022 than they were in, 2020, uh, in 2014. And of course, that made a huge difference when uh, President Putin uh, decided to attack Ukraine. Mm -hmm. 